Hello, NJRoot22.com here with a special Thanksgiving Black Friday edition of uh, the Supermarket Roundup. Um, I'm filming this on uh, Thanksgiving morning before we head out into the uh, into the events for the day. Uh, but I, I was going to do this last night, but uh, let's just talk about it. It's a kind of a packed with flyers this week. So, what am I talking about? Let's start off with Kings. Not, not impressed. Again, they uh, they have this big front and center hot deals for Black Friday week, whatever that means. Um, as always, there's really nothing nothing to write home about. Uh, there's a couple I will point out though. However, uh, they have the Lacroix. That's a good deal. If you like orange juice, they have their orange juice. <coughs> Excuse me, Black Friday. Uh, it's like it comes out to two dollars a, a 59 ounce container. Another thing I saw that was pretty decent is they have the Bell and Evans chicken nuggets for your kids. Uh, those are half price basically, uh, seven forty nine. <coughs> Excuse me, Jesus, for two uh, two packages. And next is uh, we're gonna quickly talk about IGA, uh, which is Bishop's White House, Pennington Food Market down there on Route Thirty One. Um, really not much to write home about either, except they have uh, organic blueberries uh, for two ninety nine a container. We think that. Uh, there's an ongoing debate in here. Does organic really, really matter? Or is it just something you do to feel good about yourself? Because uh, what, 70% of the organic products tested had some sort of non-organic pesticides or whatever on them? I don't know. Uh, Hatfield bacon, it's not, it's not our favorites. One of the worst, but $2.99, you can't go wrong to save money. And uh, they have these meat franks. Uh, Hatfield, again, not a, not one of our favorite brands, but it says selected varieties are 99 cents. You'll you'll see inside that there it's not the beef franks. I think it's just the chicken and pork franks. And this is interesting. I, IGA here is touting it's the store brand that's name brand. Are they saying that uh, the name brands make all their things sort of the way Aldi Aldi does? Um, they got some organic stuff uh, on sale here. You can see, you know, strawberries, frozen strawberries. It's always good to have in the freezer. And here, here's the uh, Hatfield. Uh, you can see the beef franks are four bucks. So it's, uh, beef franks, I think, uh, taste significantly better when you eat them by your, by themselves. I don't use buns, so that uh, that uh, that makes a difference. You can really taste uh, taste taste the difference. Stop and shop. I say no. I'm not a big fan of Stop and Shop. I mean, even though they're pretty close by to where uh, we are, we're not uh, we're not a big fan of Stop and Shop. Uh, until we find a good reason to go there regular, we're not going to give them much attention here. But they do have a good price on uh, lean ground beef, which is buck uh, ninety nine a pound when you buy it in their um, value pack, probably three or four pounds. And here, here's something uh, interesting. One of our favorite. Uh, stores out there to find good deals is Ocean State Job Lot um, and they have their typical Black Friday uh, sale going on here and it's not as good as I, I thought it would be but they have some things that are almost like no-brainers to buy if you want to save some money and I mean I recommend using re rechargeable nickel metal hydride batteries for your, all your uh, toy needs but here's something you get uh, you know, 32 batteries, AA or AAA alkaline Panasonic batteries. You pay 14 bucks, you get a $14 gift card. It's like getting them free, especially if you buy useful things from Ocean State Job Lot already. It's just dumb not to, to take advantage of this. Um, it's always good to have some throwaway batteries uh, in in your arsenal, just in case you don't you, you, you know you don't want to care about. Uh, recharging them or not losing them. And here's some good deals. I'm going to buy this. It's an omelet pan. It's one of those copper omelet pans. It's ten bucks. You get a ten dollar card. But I, I've always wanted to try one. And like I, I mean, I can make eggs and omelets without it. But it would be nice to to try it. Even if I throw it out, um, and I, or it just takes up too much room and ends up in the basement somewhere. Um, it's a free way to try it. And here they have their copper pans. They're not the best. They're not brand like brand name, and they won't last forever. But uh, if you need to make uh, little loaves or pies or or things, you pay 15 bucks uh, worth of those. You get a 15 dollar card for you. And th here's some other good ones too. These art supplies in the middle. These artist pads are great for kids. It's like getting them free. You get 
I don't know if I buy the canvas, but these artist pads are great. They really are. So that's what I recommend there this week. And here's another one for the Saturday and Sunday door busters. Um, just booster cables. It ends up being five bucks. You get 15, uh, 15 bucks, you get a $10 card. So that, I think that's it for this week on the odd lot, job lot. Um, and these knives here, they're pretty sharp. I mean, if you need a couple chef's knives or stocking stuffers to give somebody, I have one of these at home. They're not the best. I mean, they're not heavy duty. The handles are hollow, I believe, but, and it's not as balanced as some of the more expensive knives, but this is a, uh, a good deal. It's like getting free stocking stuffers. And I'm, I'm still interested about this gaming box. I mean, I've always been a gamer my whole life when I was younger, but. All right, and here's something odd this week. We're not really gonna go into ShopRite because I think they're just sort of, uh, they got their, their, uh, their, fill and there's really nothing nothing good this week uh, typical things there's no real good meats on sale they have their cheeses these cheeses are always a good deal every week so it's not it's no point in pointing them out so i'm not really going to talk about shop right this week nothing groundbreaking at all um boring this week i think so i'm not going to talk about it, but we'll make brief mention of walmart Walmart, this is interesting. They have good deals on things like a 40 inch TV at 1080p. Everybody wants 4K now, but I, I, that's ridiculous. But the thing you need to understand about all these high tech things, this, look how clean they make that look. Next year, they're gonna be obsolete practically, or you're gonna want something new. So see if you could do without it. I mean, this is a good deal, this gaming laptop. It seems, I, I don't know, I, I, would, I would recommend against tech I mean, because it's tech is bizarre. It it doesn't last long. It really, truly doesn't last long. And they they get you buy all this stuff, and you're gonna buy the similar thing in a year or two anyway. So it's it's bizarre. But the thing they do have, and and cell phones too. You're gonna need a new one in a year or two. It's it's just to hold off. Buy a used one on Amazon. Um, like two-year-old model, you get them really cheap. The thing that, that might be good at a place like Walmart this weekend are toys for the kids, because that you can't avoid the toys. It's almost like tech for kids. All this stuff, they're gonna destroy it or want new ones. Um, the toys aren't bad, and they probably have some decent things on, on some tools or, or useful items. So if you could find something you might need, functionally need for the house, um, there might be some good deals to ha have, like the, this Instapot, 59 bucks seems to be the low low bar for those those things. I mean, when they're $29, I might buy one, but, so that's that's it. Uh, most It's mostly consumer junk. And you know who has the best deals uh, this uh, Black Friday weekend is Lowe's. I mean, I, I'm, not, I'm sure Home Depot has similar good deals, but I'm not gonna get into every deal that Lowe's has here, but they have some incredible, incredible deals um, on things like that used to be really expensive. And this should be the only time, like this, these refrigerators, it was normally 2,200 bucks, 9.99. I mean, that's that's a tr profound savings. And like around Christmas time, these these um, bit kits, like 100 piece, normally 50 bucks, 17, 17.98. That's, that's really, those are really, really good deals there. They'll probably sell out. They probably just have just enough. But all throughout this entire Lowe's flyer, they had really, like very low priced items. Like for instance, I like this. This uh, these step ladders are, are extremely useful. 19 bucks, normally uh, 50, uh, 45 dollars. And they had another ladder in here that I might pick up uh, because we don't have a good folding ladder in this house. Um, and if you if I could find it in here, it's it's worth mentioning. Um, but other than that, I mean, like if you really look hard, you can find some some really good uh, deals at Lowe's. I think it was on the back, yeah. This uh, five foot ladder is normally $70, it's only $22, you cannot beat it. And we have one of these little giant ladders, they're real bulky, but they're really, they take up less room. They're like four different ladders, you can have four in one, essentially go, you can have a fold in there, but I, I don't use this, so that's why I wanna get one of these uh, guys, just for quick quick jobs, instead of having to schlep this, this thing out. So that's it. I mean, I, I really do think Lowe's has uh, the best uh, Black Friday deals um, in terms of discount savings on, on what uh, what's useful around the house. So that's it. Have a nice Thanksgiving weekend and 
I'll see what I can come up with next week.